Glenn Morgan. We're doing some Black Ops 4 today. The last video I made, which was like, what, Black Ops 4, four years later? I did the unthinkable and I reinstalled Black Ops 4 and I got back on this game. And surprisingly enough, a lot of people actually really enjoyed that video and they wanted to see more. And just like that video, make sure to drop a like. Let's see if we can bring 10,000 likes if you guys want to see some more Black Ops 4. But yeah, where we left off, I had the pick a weapon bribe. I've got a free brand new gun that I can get on this game. And I basically asked you guys, I was like, what do you suggest? What should I pick? Because I'm not all that good at Black Ops 4. I need some help. And TBH, honestly, guys, it boiled down to two guns the VMP and the Micro MG9 millimeter it kind of seemed like the consensus is that if you get the vmp you're basically just like a toxic tryhard, and this gun is like completely broken like it's basically the best gun in the game and then there's the micro mg 9 millimeter which kind of fits into the same boat but apparently you have to charge the gun up i think that's what it says yeah extremely fast fire rate with a brief spin up time i think it might have been safe to say that the last time i played black ops 4 i did not enjoy myself as much as i would have liked to all they do uh, just what the fuck <laughs> This is kind of a tough choice, but I mean, like, you guys know better than I do, so I'm, I'm gonna go for it. We're gonna unlock the VMP, the very manly pistol. I gotta do it. I'm trash at Black Ops 4, and I don't want to get completely smoked by all the sweats on this game, so let's get it. Really hope this is a good choice. And we do get five duplicate protected cases as well, so maybe I can actually get a good gun after this. Let's see. Okay, well, yeah, obviously the VMP. Everything else does not matter at all. You can either just purchase it for COD points, or you can exchange 50 crates to just get it. Interesting. What I don't understand is I unlocked the VMP. Where's my other cases? Oh, there they are. Okay. Time for a Soplin Doplin opening. It's dupe protected. I mean, I have, like, I played a decent amount of Black Ops 4. I should be able to get something good. I hope. Ah, uh, crap. Crap. Crap! Garbage! We're gonna go through the full opening. You have to do the full animation. If you don't do the full animation, you just get nothing but trash. See, now I'm gonna actually get something good this time. Oh, oh juice camo for the auger! <laughs> Three pointless camos I don't give a shit about. I love this supply drop system. Keep it coming, buddy. Who saw that coming? Oh, it's duplicate protected. Doesn't mean you're gonna get anything good. I guess I shouldn't be complaining. I mean, th this is free. Didn't have to do anything for this. I just get it. No, I am mad. Wow. They still make those? Ooh, they still make those? The only thing worse than this is the Infinite Warfare Supply Drop Robot. Drop me insane. Gotta make a class of this thing now. I'm gonna take off the unicorn gun. There it is, brand new. Oh, I wonder if it has an operator mod. Does it? Oh no, there's no god mode mod. <laughs> uh, what attachments can you get for it? Okay, actually everything's pretty basic. It doesn't have any like two times attachments. No double extended mags or anything crazy. I swear, if I got fucking trolled into unlocking this thing. <laughs> That'd actually be so great. I'm gonna put plasma drive on. Plasma drive's pretty cool. Okay, well, I have no attachments for it yet, so we gotta go get some attachments. I'll probably do a little bit of hardcore. It'd be kind of neat if we got WMD. I saw in Cold War that they had to delay the map. I don't even know why. But yeah, Cold War's got a new assault rifle. I don't know if anyone even cares to see that, but I could try to unlock it and use it on either Cold War or Warzone. I don't know. Ooh, we got Summit. We'll save that for another time, though. It's VMP try hard toxic, try hard gamer sweat time. Oh, one underneath at C. Oh, one underneath at C. I'm at B, dude. Okay, well, they're actually calling out, so this is gonna be a lot of fun. The first person- Why am I just stuck fucking planking on the ground? GET UP! Oh my gosh, he's ruining the lobby! Why does it keep doing this? Ruin, I swear you better get the fuck up. Stop taking the nap or I'll put you in the body bag. That's a ruined voice line, right? Oh. I should have had everyone- Um, um grapply. Oh, There's a double. Right. Let's go. More. Feed. Perfect. Feed time already. <laughs> we got a five man with it already. First game in hardcore. This is already going better than when I last recorded. I hit a whopping total of zero clips the last time I played. Granted, this is hardcore. I mean, I do want to. Oh, what the f was that? I do want to take this thing into core so I can see uh, how strong it is. Shit. Where was he? <laughs> He's on the little gondola. Hey, your boy got play. Look at that. Wait, it's play? Oh, yeah. You got lucky there. Yeah, very lucky. I had I had no idea people spawn here on Summit. Be locked down. <laughs> They're just getting instantly spawn trapped. He's in the gondola. Why are you still camping there? I'm just gonna defend the A sector the whole game. That's right, you miserable. F well, it's so good it just shreds right through your teammates. CXD spotted. I see it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean the graffiti. In the corner, what a surprise. Sick corner, dude. That was the same guy that was camping in the gondola. Hi, how are you? Oh, oh God. <laughs> You know, I remember the VMP being pretty good in Black Ops 3, and this is probably just a copy and paste gun. So it would make sense that this thing is actually pretty good in Black Ops 4 as well. No, we lost. Again. Wait, using thermal on the go. swordfish? This guy <laughs> is a fucking hacker. No. Just kidding, just kidding. Well, at least he just said just kidding. What, that, that was the play. What attachments did I get? I got it to level four, yippee. Oh, another case opening, can't wait. 
one. Just, just give me the micro MG 9 millimeter. You know you want to. Common dead joke sticker? The only thing here that's a dead joke is this game. <laughs> we'll use the VMP on Nuketown. Now we get to see how good the VMP actually is. This thing better be the strongest gun in the game. Oh, I'm already winning. Yes! It was worth the unlock. I already have two kills. Oh, the Black Ops timing, dude. You think you turn a corner, you think you're safe, but then two people pop out of nowhere and shoot you. Love it. This thing's amazing. Look at the reactive camo changes colors. So rad. Oh, someone's bringing out a brecci. <laughs> I think I made the right choice by picking the VMP, which thank you guys so much for the suggestions. Now when I play this game, I don't have to suffer as much. So far, I would say it doesn't feel like I have like an insane advantage over other people. At one point in Black Ops 4, there were certain guns with certain attachments that were like insanely good. Everything in here just kind of feels like on the same level though, overall. So that smoke. Oh. VMP takes zero f***ing skill, you f***ing puta. <laughs> it takes no skill. You could say that about almost every SMG. I think what I need to get on this gun is the grip. I think it's just like Black Ops 3. Like, the gun's pretty strong, but you need to have the grip on it to get rid of that side-to-side -side recoil. Once you have a grip on it, it just becomes a laser. Like, unstoppable laser gun. I think we're being scanned, but I don't give a f <gasps> Get him! <laughs> when your specialist just gets f***ed like that, oh my- I hate it! I'm beyond triggered right now. Oh my god, the torque barricades. You know, I don't know if I got to talk about that too much the last time I played Black Ops 4, but really why I don't like it as much is because the specialists are just made to be so douchey in this game. In Black Ops 3, some of the specialists were douchey, but in a fun way. In this game, it's just so tryhard and serious. Like, people, oh my, I don't even know how to describe it. A torque's barricade is the worst thing ever. Hands down, one of the worst things to ever just be in a Call of Duty game. Like, look, he's just gonna hide behind it and get kill streaks, and you die if you try to get in front of it. Like, it's just the worst. Walk into it. Oh boy, so skillful. There's people who play like this. There's people who did play like this back in Black Ops 4. Taking the lead. What? How did you- You didn't even- You stuck it to the roof! You didn't even know! I can't catch a break with my specialist. You know, that's how it goes in a game like this. Everyone has their specialist, and if you don't get to use it, you just get instantly shut down, then it pisses you off. It's just not fun. It's supposed to be your one opportunity to have a fighting chance or get a multi-kill and actually have some fun. But no, you just get killed by some cheap bullshit instead. We lost that game too. I do kind of feel like overall I am doing better by having this nerdy ass gun. It does seem to be the sweaty weapon of choice. How about y'all use a real fucking gun? <laughs> I'm a fucking little pea shooter. How dare y'all use the pea shooter? Dog shit. Yeah, dog shit. Back in my trailer park, I use the shotguns. That's a real man's gun. I was gonna say, though, I think I overall enjoy this more in hardcore, especially in a game like Black Ops 4, where you have people using armor, they're playing Crash, they're giving everyone extra health. You can't hit clips like that. It's just not fun. I'm trying to shoot juggernauts with, like, a thousand health. It's just how it is. I like to rush around and play aggressively, hit the clips. That's how it's always been and how it always will be. I don't want to fall asleep camping behind a barricade. Oh. Oh, area denial. So cool. This game is so tactical! It's the most super tactical Call of Duty game ever! Oh my god. Yeah, just camp mid. Oh, that's so much fun. Very tactical. Tactical gameplay. Yeah, just keep standing there the whole f What a blast. Is it possible to have PTSD from playing a video game you hate? Because I swear I have it from playing this game. Anytime I get back on and play this game, there's just like this weird feeling. I don't know if it's anxiety. Something visceral that I just despise about this game. Oh, cool. <laughs> he used his gravity spike. <laughs> no, this dude did not just use it at the very last second. That's all. Awesome. Enemy sniper's nest inbound. Enemy sniper's nest. Oh, we get for all of our kill streaks. Now we're saving them for the second round of domination. Oh boy. I'm done. We'll do some safeguard. Why not? I'll probably still lose my mind, but I, I like safeguard. <laughs> And I am dead. Oh, you missed your crossbow shot. You gonna miss it again? Oh, you got an actual gun? Oh. I'm gonna go in here and kill you now with my broken gun. It's so broken. Oh, my gun's so broken. It's broken. Get it. <laughs> that dude is so mad. Yeah, just do it. The VMP is too easy. Come on, man. Why do you keep spawning on it? Shoot it! Why are you stopping? You're never gonna be introduced into Infinite Warfare 2 at this rate. 
cooled. Good to see everyone's trying to play the objective. Willing to bet we lose in like 10 seconds. They already have it where we just had the robot at the end of the game. Oh my God. I can't. I, I fuck it. Dude! Basically, the IED from Call of Duty Ghost. So I, I can't with this game. I can't. All right. Please die. Man, the VMP is actually not bad for killing the robot. We got this awesome trap set down here. I can't shoot it. <laughs> I was trying to fight. No! Oh! <laughs> 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 Fucking dying animal music. Makes me sick. This is my last chance to enjoy this gun. Alright, I've got I got the special Bravo 6 going dark goggles. Come on. Oh, there they are. Nope. It's already over? I didn't get to shoot one person! Oh my god! I think I honestly just had my expectations too high. I thought this was gonna somehow transform the game and like make me like Black Ops 4, but it just doesn't. Like, you can't just get a new gun in the game and suddenly like it, even if you hit a feed. Anytime I shit talk a call to the game, I swear I just start hitting feeds. I don't know how the fuck I either get that lucky or the timing is just that ridiculous. But yeah, I mean, just because I have the VMP, it doesn't make me like this game anymore. I could be hitting these feeds with non-DLC guns. It doesn't really matter. You can't just add one gun into a Call of Duty game you don't like and expect it to completely change your opinion. It's just no, no. It's just like the new gun that Treyarch is adding to Cold War. Like, just because there's a new gun in Cold War, it doesn't mean that I'm gonna suddenly love Cold War. We, how do we lose? We lost by two kills? Oh my god. I can't get one fucking win in this game. Good lord. How do you go three to seven as Torque? This is what I'm saying, man. People claim to love this game, but all they do is sit behind a fucking rectangle the whole game. Getting three kills and dying seven times. I don't even know how you managed to do that. How can you sit? <laughs> Oh my How can you sit behind a barricade the whole game and still not do well? I'm done. I I'm calling it here. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me unlock the VMP in Black Ops 4 and still not really enjoying the game. <laughs> if you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see some more Black Ops 4 or some other throwback Call of Duty stuff, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. We are taking the lead! A bomb being planted on our ammo supply! A bomb being planted on our ammo supply!